Uh, what would you recommend for someone making a reel when most of their work is diverse and doesn't mesh well? Good question. And again, I, I'm going to often say like I've experienced this because that was the case. Yeah, look, at when I, I used to, again, I, I mentioned earlier, like I used to work in, before working in the script that I worked in everything. I mean, like talk shows, award shows, news, uh, I mean, sports, you name it. So I was trying to make a reel and uh, what I did, and I suggest you do as well. I, for me, reels, I, I really think it's a, about the music. Uh, I mean, it's, it's, I'm gonna say it's a big part. That in this case, when you have so many different projects, for example, I try to connect everything with like, with the music, right? Just finding the right track that connects everything that kind of fits like the energy and tone of all the clips that I'm showing, right? Like, for example, like I, I remember doing a reel where it was very, you know, uh, it was like a lot of action, you know, it had like boxing on there, it had like this award show intro where this guy like jumps off a cliff, you know, and parachutes down and had some like, uh, like a fight there. On, I mean, just a lot of action, cool stuff. And so like I picked like just something energetic, right? I think is understanding the tone, what tone you're going for and match that, say with, with material that you're showing and pick the right song for it. So really pay attention. Like, again, it's telling a story. How am I, how am I telling a story and setting the tone with my clips? Um, and that's where you have to start getting creative and then finding that just the right music. You know, also at times and also, you know, say maybe switching up the music, doing really good music transitions. I mean, that, that's, that shows a lot about you editing music, right? So maybe also speeding things up, then slowing things down and getting creative with that, but with the music and sound effects. Really also, you know what? I think with sound effects, really just beefing that up, you know, make it interesting. If you're gonna add text, interesting text, don't, you know, again, nowadays it's just like, you need to be really creative. Create something that's, you know, highlights your story telling skills and also like your technical abilities um, is very important. And again, nowadays just, I mean, look at, there's just some great stuff out there, honestly. It has to look good and really grab someone's attention, hold them there for two or three minutes. Again, and also I would say that I wouldn't make it too long. That's the thing. I, it's like when people tell me, I did five minutes, seven minute reels. I'm like, oh, that's, that's, that's like a feature length film. Two minutes and three at the max, three max. And that even, oh, that seems like a lot. Like back in the day, you know, what I would show people clips, sometimes I would just, or material, um, I would also send individual clips to people like in an email and say, watch, like, watch this, watch this, watch this, these clips directly to that, to specifically what I want them to watch um, versus say like, here's my YouTube channel. Or here's my website. No, like send direct links. That's also uh, what I'll say about that.